Waste of your talent, Randy. He's not in that room either? Somebody told me he was in this building. Keep calling me Randy, dude. I'll find you. I'll find you. Hello, everybody. My name is Street Uber. Thanks for tuning into my channel. And in today's video, I'll be showing you how to get into the IAA building. I know that in my live stream yesterday that I said that uh, wall breaches are for noobs, but there are a couple of them that are cool. This is one of those that I think is pretty cool because you can't really like troll other players out of it or whatever. And if you're new to my channel, just go ahead and subscribe because the next 20 subscribers will get a free cartwheel lesson. And that's no joke. Just reply in the comments down below that you need your free cartwheel lesson. I'll be more than happy to give it to you. Well, with that being said, I'll be get I'll get on to the point of today's vi today's video. So, in order to do this, you're going to need a uh, cargo bob and a motorcycle. If you don't have a cargo bob available to you, you can find them in various locations around the map. And if you don't have a motorcycle in your own garage, just go ahead and strip one off the street and steal it. And then what you're going to want to do is pick up your motorcycle with the cargo bob and then make your way over to the IAA building with the cargo bob and the motorcycle uh, com combination. There you go. Once you make your way to the IAA building with your combination cargo bob motorcycle, you want to drop your motorcycle where I do right here in the video on this lower platform uh, on top of the building. And then just simply uh, land the cargo bob over on top of the building itself. And try not to like kill your friends whenever they're with you because you can get your friends in with you. That's how. Uh, that's how I did this. Then just simply climb out of the cargo bob and run over and you'll find a ladder. You'll find ladders all around us. Uh, climb this ladder right here and go down to where your motorcycle is. And then uh, get on your motorcycle. I happened to drop mine on the wrong side of this little railing right here. And Lewis had to straighten it out for me. But uh, once we got the motorcycle situated over on the right side of it, there's this little electrical panel next to this uh, looks like a vent and right next to that is where you want to try to get through on your motorcycle you kind of want to uh, go at it until you can get your motorcycle just through there I had to resituate the motorcycle a few different times to get it pointed in the right direction or get it at the right angle to get in there but eventually I was able to uh, drive right through and then once you get through there it, you just kind of fall don't do anything don't touch anything just fall straight down and you'll land inside this location that I believe is used in story mode for one of the heist or heist setups but most people get into this location using a parachute and I found that really difficult I've only got like in here like one out of five times maybe using a parachute but uh, you can get in here pretty much a hundred percent every time this way by coming in with a motorcycle instead of trying to use a parachute and then you'll notice that some weird things happened with the motorcycle right here where it was invisible and uh, Lewis wasn't I mean Lewis was excuse me for that I mean Lewis was invisible when he was on the invisible motorcycle and then when I was on the motorcycle I would be invisible to Lewis so it was kind of it's kind of really sort of glitchy and kind of neat in a way so try this out for yourself show it off to your friends uh, some of you may know about this uh, some of you don't I guess um, try it out though uh, give me a like if you like the video or if you go ahead and uh, try this out for yourself come back and like the video for me Subscribe if you're new to my channel because, no joke, I will give you a free cartwheel lesson. And everybody, please, stay tuned. 